This drone footage shows some of the 751 unmarked graves found at the site of a former residential school for indigenous children in Saskatchewan province. Announcing the discovery, the chief of the Kausas First Nation said it wasn't clear how many of the remains were those of children. He said the site was being treated as a crime scene. In 1960, there may have been marks on these graves. The Catholic Church representatives removed these headstones and today they are unmarked graves. Opened in 1899, the Maraval Residential School was one of more than 130 such facilities operated by the Canadian government and religious authorities. At least 150,000 Native American, Métis and Inuit children were forcibly separated from their families and placed in the schools where many were mistreated and abused. At least 4,000 of them died there. Last month, the remains of 215 children, some as young as three, were found buried at the site of another former school near Kamloops in British Columbia. In a statement, Prime Minister Justin Trudeau said the discoveries were part of a larger tragedy and a shameful reminder of the systemic racism, discrimination and injustice faced by Indigenous peoples. The government formally apologised for the system in 2008, but these latest discoveries have reopened old wounds about a lack of information and accountability, casting a spotlight on a dark chapter in Canada's history. The Kansas First Nation says it expects more graves will be discovered on former school grounds. It's also calling for an apology from the Pope.